So you guys have been hearing me rant about these burritos for a little bit now. So I figured you might want to see what this shit's really about. What we got here is regular grilled chicken burrito with refried beans and no salsa from Taqueria Vallarta in Felton, California. I don't know where all that shit, you know, I just smoked the bowl. Don't do what I do. Leo? You're a good boy. 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 Down. Uh, I'd say this is, comparatively speaking, since I do get one every, like every day, um, it's a little bit heavier than than usual, but it's a it's pretty much standard. I'd call this one like a B, a solid B. Uh, that that is on the classic grading scale of A through F. Um, but two days ago, I had like a A minus. I mean, it was probably about a quarter of an inch thicker all the way around. That's what she said. And something about, they even like toasted the, the tortilla, which adds a whole nother layer of flavor, a whole nother dimension. And something about the chicken that day, it was extra crispy. It was like, like they took the time to really grill it before putting it in the burrito. And I understand it gets busy. You don't always have time to add those little extra details, but you know, those two combined with a little bit fatter than usual burrito. It was on point. It was delicious. And you know, I let him know too. I'm like, hey, yesterday was fucking on. And yeah. Whether they care, I don't fucking know. But all right, let's see. All right. I like to open from the wide side. So they didn't toast or grill, whatever you want to call it, the tortilla this time. Um, sometimes that can make the tortilla a little bit doughy. Let's go in. No, Leo, this isn't for you. This isn't for you. Down, over here. All right, fuck it. I guess you don't get the close up. go off all right just to get the close up which is dark as fuck in here anyway okay it's good it's a strong B all the way around um, there's nothing necessarily wrong with it today but it's not exceeding expectations this should be the baseline this should be the expectation of what you get each time anything less than this is bullshit but um this is what keeps me coming back when it's better it's it's bonus so yeah let's go in for some more mm -hmm. oh, good boy Alright. Oh man. 
This is a good piece too. See, look at this piece of chicken right here. All right, Leo, give me a high five. Hey, down, high five. All right, good boy. Good boy. God, that was painful giving that piece up. Good boy. I shouldn't have said anything. Eat your food. He started eating his food. Hey, careful. Strawberries and cream pie. That's my pie. JJ's pie. Um, I would prefer like a berry kind of jelly jam in there or even just straight vanilla. But yeah, fuck it. No, I, I, I love fucking vanilla flavored shit. And you know what? We'll leave it at that. Um, but that'll be dessert. And uh, yeah, let's go in. Daddy needs his calories and his protein. Give an inch to take all seven. aren't fucking flares. I'll tell you that. Leo, you're blowing it, bro. I don't know if you can hear Leo sniffing around. Eat your food. That's your food. Daddy can't eat your food. I know you understand me. It's truly heartbreaking to stare into those eyes. He's got his little lip stuck to his teeth. I know. I'm sorry. But, you know, you're, you're just going to swallow it. You're not even going to chew it. And then you're going to want another. You just need to eat your food. Or, well... I need to finish this shit. Hope you edit that out.
the critical drinker is freaking hilarious. Mm. Yep, that was the last bite. Now he starts eating his food. You also get complimentary zips on the salsa, but they did not put the salsa in. Well, and to be fair, I did say no salsa, but nine out of ten times they usually put it in there. All right. A little palate cleanse here. Four hundred calories. Still under what I need to be. So I'll even call it a dirty bulk. I mean, a dirty cut. This one has a little flesh wound. Let's go in with the flesh wound. See the vanilla in there and they're two definitely two different textures you can actually suck out the jelly part too which um something that goes back to when i was a kid and i used to dismantle like reese's peanut butter cups like eat all the chocolate off and then have just like a little slab of peanut butter left over or twix like eat all the caramel off and the chocolate on the sides and then just eat the little cookie by itself fucking weirdo Was fucking staring at me. Mm. Let's give the palate a cleanse. Don't even think about it. little pocket of jelly right there if you can see that mm. strangely enough these can be hit or miss too I mean they're usually consistent it's a wrapped product a manufactured product but depending on how fresh they are will depend on like the ones that are older the two like different substances inside the vanilla creme and the wait for the creme and the jelly in there they'll start to come together and it'll kind of fuse and not only will fuse it'll start to seep into the crust i suppose and so you kind of have this just you know what i mean it's kind of like becomes like one solid thing i mean it, it still is the same item i mean i i don't want to give the idea that it becomes something completely different but it's just not as good 
as the fresher batches. Uh, so. Even just the texture of the crust and the glaze on the outside, the older ones, the glaze will, it must be absorbed by the, by the crust because it's not as like, like this, it's flaking off everywhere. It's like, it's fucking everywhere. Um, but sometimes you won't get that. Like you, sometimes they don't even look glazed. Like here you can see it wrapped all around the bottom. And uh, a lot of times you don't have that. That could be something that happens at the factory too. Some will get a heavier coat. I'm sure you've all watched Discovery and shit. <laughs> Worst thing about these is finishing them. I could easily do two of these. In fact, the closer I get to finishing, the more I realize how fucking hungry I still am. Fuck, that was delicious. Thank you for joining me. Till the next one.